It's time to preview some women's CONCACAF Gold Cup qualifying in League A, Group B between Guatemala and Jamaica, and it wraps up on Sunday, December 3rd at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. This game between Guatemala, Las Chapinas, and Jamaica, the reggae girls will have a serious say in how this group ends. Now, while watching, if you're liking this content, please give this video a like to help spread this channel. Now, let's take a look at the table right now in this group. And first place is Panama at 2 1 and 1. They have seven points. Guatemala come in second at 1 1 and 1 with four points. And Jamaica are third at 0 2 and 1 with two points. Now, Jamaica will either be done or they'll move into the preliminary playoff spot that's currently held by Guatemala if they can get the win. For Guatemala, if, if they lose this game, they'll either be eliminated or they actually can still claim top spot overall with a win and a win by at least five goals. So it's still all to play for here in this final game of the group. Looking at the odds, the odds makers cannot split these two teams right now. Both Guatemala and Jamaica are given plus 137 odds to get the win here. The draw comes in at plus 260. A bet on over 2.5 goals is minus 154. Under 2.5 is plus 120. These odds being at bet 365. Let's look at their games so far in this group. Guatemala, they lost at home to Panama 3-0. They won in Panama 3-2. And they also tied this Jamaican team 2-2. Jamaica lost in Panama 2-1. They tied at home to Guatemala 2-2. And they tied at home to Panama 1-1. For Guatemala, they've had a variety of scores. Montereso, uh, Ana Martinez with two. Ramirez, Solorzano, Garcia has also scored. Now, those goals have come from... If you look at how they've gotten their goals, three from open play, one from a header, and one from a PK. Jamaica has also had several different scores. Walker, Johnson, Vidare, and Buckley. All four of Jamaican's goals, Jamaica's goals have come from open play. The previous meeting between these teams in this group, when they last met, it was a 2-2 two -two draw. The teams traded goals in the first half, Guatemala scoring first, and then Jamaica tying soon after in the 28th minute and the 32nd minute. And so that was tied 1-1 at half. Going into the second half, they again quickly traded goals back and forth. This time Jamaica taking the lead in the 52nd and Guatemala tying in the 56th. Ana Martinez, the Guatemala captain, she had six shots, one assist in the game. Aisha Solorzano had four shots and one goal. Now this is the only, or that was the only, historical meeting between these teams where they've ever played. If we look at some trends here, Guatemalans games have seen goals. If we look back at all competitions, not just looking at this qualifying, but in all their recent competitions, over 2.5 goals has now hit in four straight games and also in 18 of 20 games. And if you go back even further, in 25 of 29 games, they've also conceded though a goal in 11 of their past 12. For Jamaica, now they've been ice cold since the Women's World Cup. Since that one nothing loss to Colombia, that eliminated them. They've yet to win in any of their next nine matches in any competition, being 0-2-7. They've also been outscored 34-6. to now, Not surprisingly, they conceded in all nine of those games too, given they've given up so many goals. Bets on over 2.5 will be 7-1, and and both teams to score is 3-0 and in their recent games of late as well. Now, if we come back into the, just the CONCACAF Gold Cup qualifying games, Guatemala has created 37 goal-scoring situations in three games with 18 shots on target. Jamaica has tw created 24 goal-scoring situations with seven shots on target. Now, now, let's get into the best bet for this game that I see. And I think if we look at some of the both teams to score trends in qualifying, we've seen both teams to score go 2-1 and one in qualifying for Guatemala, while both teams to score a perfect 3-0 and for Jamaica during their qualification. Now, both teams need to get something from this game. Jamaica definitely need to get the win to advance. For Guatemala, they ideally need a win and a big win so they can get direct qualification. They certainly don't want to drop into third. Now, both teams also have been involved with plenty of games, seeing lots of goals lately, not just in qualifying, but overall. So I think, even though I don't see this bet currently available at Bet365, once the game gets closer, perhaps some more markets will open up. I do like the both teams to score bet, perhaps both teams to score and over 2.5. Right now, over 2.5 looks like the best bet from what is available. Now, if you like this content, please sure, be sure to give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, and good luck with all of your bets this year.